This local sports report is presented by Woodhull Logistics, a proud supporter of the Cambridge Rivulets. Woodhull is a full-service logistics company offering a wide range of transportation solutions based on the specific needs of the customer. Learn more about their services by visiting wood-hall.com. The Cambridge Rivulets back of the gardens on Friday night. The Rivs would play host to the Etobicoke Dolphins. The Rivs, 3-0 this season, looking to keep their early momentum coming and stay perfect. Jumping into the first pier, the Dolphins on the rush. Taylor Thompson cuts outside and plays a low shot on net. Jordana DiMarinas swallows it up and holds on for a whistle. Cambridge right back the other way, and it's a good fight from the Rivs. Reese Reed finds it in the middle, and she goes forehand, backhand. Hannah Clark gets a pat on it and keeps it scoreless. Later in the frame now, Etobicoke back on the rush and watch the move from Emma Beauchamp. She pulls it into the middle. Jordana DiMarinas marks the shot out front and keeps it out. Jumping to the second pier, now still scoreless. The Rivers on the forecheck looking to find the opener. Bronwyn Langes finds an inside pass for Emma Thornton, and Emma finishes it. That's the opener for the Rivers, and they take a 1-0 lead early in the second. The Dolphins back the other way look to respond. It's a good move from Sophia Ishmael. She pulls it to the slot and fires. Jordana DiMarinas makes the stop. The Rivers netminder playing well, and minutes later, the Rivers would help her out. Madeline Kim aims high from the point, and Maddie goes bar down for a beauty! What a shot from Madeline Kim, and it's 2-0 Rivs. The Dolphins trailing by a pair and lay in the frame, they cut into that lead. Emma Beauchamp crashes the net, and she pokes it in! So Tobico is on the board, heading to the third. In the third, now more from the Dolphins. Sophia Ishmael centers, Adriana Milani slams it in! That's the equalizer from Adriana, and it's 2-2 earlier in the third. Tied at 2-2 now anyone's game and it's the Dolphins with a shorthanded chance to take the lead. Mackenzie Alexander breaks it on net and goes for the forehand and Mackenzie's got the go-ahead goal. So it's 3-2 Etobicoke. Final minute of the third now the Rivers with their net empty pressing to force overtime. It's a couple good stops from Hannah Clark but the puck's still loose out front. Maeve O'Hagan finds it and buries it. That's a huge goal for Maeve and this one would need overtime. In overtime now the Dolphins with the puck. Reese Logan controls it out high and looks for a lane. She cuts inside and aims high, and Reese roofs the game winner! So a good game between two good teams, and in the end, it's an Etobicoke Dolphins win as they take it in overtime. This one ending with a final score of 4-3 on Friday.